off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Alright, Jason and I just got back from running errands We went to Costco again Third time this week, you know Third time's a turn. So, as soon as I come home, I can ask everyone in the family, do we need anything? Do we need anything? And everyone says no, or they give me a few things, and then as soon as I go, well, we need mouthwash. And I was like, well, why didn't you tell me yesterday? <laughs> you knew yesterday that it was gone. So, got a few things for the store. What did we get? Oh, and we got our Halloween candy. Halloween Is that still candy? in my car? Yeah, I just realized it's all the costs for that. Leave it in my hand, car. Hand soap. Leave it in my car. It's going to yeah. be cold enough. We yeah, don't need yeah. to. And we purposely didn't buy the chocolate Halloween candy. Yes. And we bought it very close to Halloween so that we don't get tempted to eat it. And I'm going to leave it sealed in my car. He likes licorice. I'll be fine. As long as you keep it in your car. Keep it in my car. And I'm not opening the bag. Um, but what I am opening. Otherwise, you've been enjoying my stimulating conversation today. He's driven me absolutely <laughs> insane. If you guys thought the banter before was, it was good because it was funny. Oh, he's just been irritating me to no end this morning. But right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean this bag. You guys have seen how gross and dirty this bag is. And I really wish the strap was, um, was detachable because really that's all I need to go ahead and wash but instead i'm gonna have to wash the whole thing so i am just emptying it out luckily it's pretty quick I'm just making sure it's all emptied out here nickel what else is in here so we're gonna go ahead and clean this out but it also means but it means i need to take these pins off and I like that I've attached them to the front of this bag like this because when they come apart, like I've had one of them come apart, then that just goes inside the bag. Um, but it also means that maybe when I put them back on, I rearrange them and I put a few more of my extra pins on that I collected when we went to Oahu. So we're gonna, let's see what's in my bag. Also, where we, we we haven't had game night, so I can get get up give up my Kraken pin since we were in Hawaii, and uh, it was funny because that was it that day they had said who has the Kraken pin because um, they were playing oh they were they were having a game night when we were gone our friends were and they were like well who has the Kraken pin uh, you know because one of them won it and they're like I need the Kraken pin and I took a photo of myself on the beach <laughs> and I was like then come and get it. <laughs> and she's like, I will. I'll hop on a plane to come to Hawaii. So I still have a Kraken pin, but we have, our schedules are all so crazy that we can't get together for another couple weeks. We might go to dinner with one of the couples tomorrow night because they can get together, but we won't be playing games. Okay, aside from the little pins, we have my bag. I'm going to go, I think I'm going to wash it by hand and then put it in the dryer. I'm gonna get some Dawn dish soap. You didn't find your little ring? No. Can you go look up by my bed though? All or, right. And by my makeup table? Because I take it off when I'm, it, if it's anywhere, it might be by my makeup table. My little mag safe, my case, what do they call it? Anyway, a little magnet that goes back on the back of my um, phone to create a little hoop loop for my finger. I've lost that this morning. So, I was really hoping the sink was clean from loading and starting the dishes. We're having a problem with one of our children not doing her chore. <laughs> I won't say who. Just happens to be the one who needs to unload that causes other people to not be able to do their chores. All of the people to be able to do their chores because one person needs to load, another person needs to clear off and wipe the counters, which can't be done if there's dirty dishes on it which then leads to someone who sweeps the floor can't do their job when the person hasn't done the counter. Everyone's job is important and all interconnects. I'm trying to teach my kids this, like your job is just as important because it relates to someone else's task. <sighs> Teaching kids responsibility. One dish full of sink at a time. 
Okay, so I'm gonna put the camera down. We are gonna clean out the sink now. I have a clean place to wash my um, purse. Little tip, either store your utensil holder in the sink to wash their dishes, wash the utensils, or what we do is we fill a cup with water so that utensils can soak while they're, you know, being, while there's, there's time to wait to load it. Even if it's only like a half hour to an hour, then the dishes all come cleaner. You know what I mean? So, I'm gonna clean out the sink really quick. We're gonna fill it with some hot water. And then, um, I was gonna just use laundry detergent, but I don't know, maybe I'll just use Dawn. Yeah, I have Dawn. Just use dish soap, it'll be good. Yeah, I think dish soap will get out some of the oils um, and the dirt better than, see, isn't that gross? All right. All right, Jason is doing Kaylee's job. I guess we just gave away who's not doing their job. Kaylee's not here. Kaylee went out of town for, oh, you're still unloading. Kaylee went out of town for the weekend to be with her friend who's away at college. So he's doing her dishes, which probably means he'll do a little bit of Ashley's um, just to get it done. And we lost two straws to the dishwasher. No, 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 no. Let me wash my purse first. No, just, he's going to, his tendency is going to want to like dump it in here. But I've got my purse in. I'm gonna let it soak in here for a minute. Ugh, so gross. It's kind of scary to like wash something like this, but I know it's gonna really help it. I also took off this little expander so it can wash separately. This is hot, hot water. Yeah, I'll, I'll soak it here in a minute. Here, just oh, turn it on or put the, yeah, here. No, here, I'll soak this in here. Turn the water on. I won't be able to do all this, so I'll just give some up for us. No, I, no, we can put the plates in. Everything just with these bowls. We can rinse those when I um, get this done. Okay. I'm going to leave that soaking for, I'm going to like, you easily like a half hour. Because I was scrubbing it with a brush and it was really not coming clean. So I'm going to let it soak in this and then rinse it off and see. And then I might actually use some uh, actual like laundry soap next. I might just do both. Um, but I'm gonna sit and work on the computer for a second. We went to Red Robin for lunch. Ashley will be mad. Actually, Ashley and Chelsea will probably be mad. So I'm gonna hide the evidence. <laughs> uh, we just wanted to like, we had a lot to talk about this morning. Just kids and life and having surgery and all that kind of stuff. Planning the Christmas party for church. And I need to make sure I have enough time um, to schedule that party with um abby surgery right at the same time but also with um his ability to like take the time off work for both things so it's a lot so we went to lunch to talk about it and um he's actually sitting oh he he jason has wondered or learned the wonder of the wonderfulness of my little couch space upstairs. So he's taken, he's taken his computer, his checkbook, his, all of his invoices, all of his <laughs> pre-orders and mag and like his ordering books up to our bedroom to watch a show while he does his ordering. When I'm home alone, I tend to leave this blind um, shut because it gives me the ability to see someone come to the front door through this window but then this window is closed. This window here is closed. So I can walk past it and peek on them out this window to see if it's a pest control guy or like other church, like other churches that happen to do missionary work <laughs> come to the door. Women, you know who I'm talking about. Um, Cause I had one yesterday and I was like, I was here, but he didn't see me because there's like trees in front of the window. And I saw him, a pest control guy, go to the front door. And I was like, quickly turned off my phone ringer on my phone, like any sounds, and texted Kaylee and Abby upstairs. I'm like, don't answer the doorbell. Bing! And the doorbell rang. And I was like, it's pest control. Don't make a sound. <laughs> I was like, I'm not answering the door. Anyway, I'm going to sit here and work on a few things and not be bothered. 
Okay, so here's a fun thing, a fun video that I want to do. Kind of for myself, and I was going to save it for my birthday, but that's too far away. So I have, if you've been with me for a while, you know that I, I save gift certificates, gift receipts, or gift cards, um, little things like that for my birthday and I take it and I go and spend the day spending money on myself that's technically free money. Well, I have all of that right now. <laughs> you guys, I added it up the other day and um, I have $220. Um, $220 in gift cards. I have my Costco rebates from the P&G um, rebate that I did. Do you remember when I bought all the P&G products, the laundry soap, the detergents, all that kind of stuff? Got my rebate in. It does take like eight weeks or so to get, but I have $50 at Costco. I actually bought this sweater and I have two, one, two other ones that are like it um, the other day and I forgot to use this. So I get to go again. <laughs> but these are only $10. Isn't that cute? Um, so I have $50 at Costco to go and spend and I don't know if it's gonna be on a kid for Christmas it can be but then I have a DoorDash card from one of you and I have um, movie tickets to go and use because of that movie that we had the fire department called <laughs> you guys remember that I haven't redeemed those tickets we actually might go and see the movie um, it's the birth of the FBI it's a uh, what is the movie called it hasn't come out yet I've read the book all of us have read it for book club but Jason hasn't read it and the, but the other some of the other husbands are going to um what is it called <sighs> no I can't oh flower flower moon I forget what it's called but it's really really good so we're gonna try and go to that in November but then I have free movie passes for that Jason gave me a gift certificate to go get my nails done um I just chose a different salon when I got these nails put on um, just because of logistics I needed to go right then. I have a, a Target gift card that I can go and spend money on. And there was another one. No, that's it. So I kind of feel like I should do a video now on the importance of stacking up your, your gift cards and going to like splurge on yourself or your family. I might use the, the Costco one to buy stuff for the family for Christmas. It's like free money, right? Like it's free money. I didn't buy any of this stuff, so it is technically free kind of hard to like have all this stuff just sitting on my counter I don't like messes and clutter so deal with that being here I'm gonna get some work done we'll let the purse soak and then we'll come back to washing it Chelsea just got home and look what she's using as her purse today yeah. her banana grams her backpack today I mean it is pretty creative I don't think anyone else had a no, banana gram like baskets and buckets yeah, boxes and I think that's pretty creative. You even had a handle, so you're gonna go put all the banana grams back in it. Oh yeah. And what's Chelsea's standard answer for how is school today? Sleepy. I'm tired. Yeah. Good night. Good night. <laughs> it's literally she's gonna eat and then gonna sleep and then it's Friday, so she won't do homework. Ew. Will you do homework? Oh well, cause you're emptying that bag. Okay, love you. Okay, just rinse this off. I actually forgot about it for a while, so it's been like an hour. But I do think it came clean better than it was. Um, still a little darkness around the edges, but I do think it did come pretty clean. Um, better than it was. So I have rinsed it off. It's pretty soaked. I'm gonna put it into the dryer with like a towel, like a just a regular bath towel. There's like crumbs on the counter. <laughs> it's like picking up every crumb. I'm gonna put it in with just a bath towel into the dryer and uh, let it dry that way. I may not dry it all the way, but we'll start it. Okay, the buckle is already like clanking around a ton. And so I'm gonna clip it together. I clipped it to this little keychain thing. I'm actually going to zip it into the inside of the purse here. Okay, that's much better. You can still hear the metal from the zippers. But I do wonder if it's going to like come loose. I wonder if it's already come loose. Oh my goodness sakes. That was like seconds. Hmm. Okay, 
we're resulting to a zip tie. <laughs> I'm gonna zip tie the zipper together because I want this to dry without the, I don't wanna ruin the buckle. So we're gonna zip tie these together tight and get this strap to stay <laughs> locked inside the purse. See if that works. I actually don't think it's gonna work. <laughs> oh well, it'll be what it is. Okay, can you tell what I'm getting ready for? Here's my straw. <laughs> and here is my Stanley logo. Can you see it down there? I just got it taped to my shirt. And Ashley is getting her costume on and I'm frantically trying to dry my purse still. Did not think it would take this many attempts and I'm letting it do the whole buckle thing and it's probably destroying the buckle or the inside of the dryer, but I need to take my purse to this trunk or treat at Ashley's school um, in, I don't even know how many minutes. I need to leave in like 10, 15 minutes. So I'm gonna give that some time to finish up and then I'll show you Ashley's costume. She's getting ready, but she's a little anxious. So I hope people understand my costume my little, you know, my little handle. I am wondering if the lady did like a pool noodle for a handle, but I'm not gonna worry about it. Okay, Miss Care Bear. Yeah. You like your costume? Yeah. Are you wearing both ears? Just taking the extra one. Put the extra one in your bag. She's got a cute little trick or treat bag. I don't know why you're wearing the necklaces. Maybe you're trying to not be grumpy. <laughs> we gotta let the shirt just hang low. I know, Alright, you're cute. And you don't want to wear a jacket, right? No. Okay. Just keep me warm anyway. And, then I have and we'll do more. We're gonna more. we're gonna do makeup and space buns for ears no. on Halloween, but not and tonight. Bracelets. Yeah, she's been making bracelets. Out of the woods. Earless. Fearless. Red. Apparently Taylor Swift's 1989 just came out last night and everyone is obsessed with it, including me. <laughs> Midnight. Okay. And she's taking orders yeah. to make some for all of her friends and your teacher. Yeah. And then reputation. And but reputation. reputation. Rep. So I like rep. that. Here at the trunk or treat for the school. It is 44 degrees, feels like 41, and it's gonna get down to 30 degrees tonight. So, Ashley is rethinking <laughs> how cold she is right now. And so I am getting a jacket to put underneath her, we're gonna take our Care Bear T-shirt off. We didn't unload, load from Costco today. We got batteries, Soap, mouthwash, and candy, which we're leaving here in the trunk, unopened. But I gotta find her jacket, the black one. I really hope it's in here. Did not find her black cheer jacket, which is a lot warmer. I did find a pink sweatshirt. I'm trying to see if Jason can bring me her jacket. He's taking down the haunted forest with his friend. Otherwise, he would have been here tonight. But he's been there for a couple hours, so I'm hoping he can, he can just break free, go grab a bite to eat, and then come here, and then go back. But anyway, it's really cold. Does it all become for granted with a wedding? Yeah. Oh wait, we're what? focused, focus, focus. What is that? All right. Oh, yeah. um, no, it's just cool. Jason was able to come down and meet us and be with us for just a little bit here at the end of the trunk or treat. And like, I don't know if it had occurred to me another time, but like Elizabeth, your mom, mm -hmm. she was like, it's our last trunk or treat. And I was like, why'd you say that? Why'd you tell me that tonight? Mm -hmm. 
Oh, we can go. What the heck? heck? All right, sorry, my tire is getting caught on the edge of the grass and concrete. I didn't hit anything, but like, it felt like I was running into a tree and yet I wasn't anywhere near the tree. Anyway, I've got um, one friend here with us to go home. The other one had to go home and be with her dad for the evening. Her mom is out of town. And um, are you, you guys are warming up? Yeah. Do you want me to turn on air back there? I'm cold, my fingertips. Okay, let me turn on your air back there. Um, but that was fun. You guys had a good time? Yeah. Your last trunk or treat. I mean, I mean, we could still go to more. <laughs> Are you going to come with other younger friends next year? Yeah. I mean, yeah. Yeah, I guess so. I guess you could. I have a friend that's in there. Too. All right. Well, we're going to go get food because we're hungry. Hey. And um, then they're going to come back to the house and hang out for a little bit. And then we'll take her home in a couple hours. Uh weird i don't know why i didn't think about it like being your last one ashley oh no it's not no, I, no who are you gonna come with next year yeah you're I'm just gonna come with her i mean, I mean mckenna will come with her sister they, so i can see that six really, yeah. i guess so all right all right but well chelsea won't come anymore that's chelsea i don't know chelsea doesn't come with you no she wouldn't come with us huh mm -hmm. you look all weird and red back there but we did um, determine that we need to come dressed warmer mm -hmm. for Halloween night. Um, I and think it's going to be colder on Halloween night. It is going to be colder. It is 40 you, degrees. You but I bet it feels like colder than that. Like I bet the feels like is less than 40. So what am I doing on the couch at 1040 p.m.? You might ask. Waiting for Jimmy Fallon with Taylor Swift. Abby was too tired. Ashley, go get me a face wipe. I'm, I'm done for the day, but I have agreed to stay up for Abby and myself. I'm curious. All the eggs, what are they called? Easter eggs Easter. on TikTok and social media have led us to believe that something with Taylor Swift is getting released tonight on Jimmy Fallon because she did it the same way back in 2014. Correct? Yeah. And so... Karma. And Jimmy Fallon released a TikTok just like an hour or two ago. With a cardigan. With a cardigan. And it was glitching. And it was glitching. So something, and all the guests, including Depeche Mode, which Depeche Mode is one of my faves from growing up, was wearing something with a snake on it. And so that is the side of reputation. Reputation. So we're waiting. I have 20 minutes until Jimmy Fallon is on and we can get this solved really quickly and then go to bed but I'm I'm a good mother to stay up even I'm literally I'm, I'm so cold I've, I've still got my little costume on my my pajamas which is very convenient I've still got my like puffy vest on and I'm like fully in a blanket sitting in front of the fireplace and my toes just barely got warm so I'm gonna come back to you in 20 minutes and give our reaction to Jimmy Fallon if anything truly happened I, I, time will tell. We'll find out. <laughs>